Yeah, so I have been in the dental profession for 18 years and I'm currently a mobile dental hygienist. So I have lots of experience. I've heard from all kinds of common patient questions. So let me help you with sensitive teeth. This is definitely something that I find a lot of people struggle with, but you don't have to. So do you have sensitive teeth? Do you find you're chewing on one side of your mouth because the other side is sensitive? You can't eat cold foods, um, cold beverages, you really are avoiding cold things. Now keep in mind, no tooth likes the cold, but if you have ice cream as an example and you're in pain for more than a second, like, oh my goodness, this really hurts, that's not normal. But if you're eating ice cream and it's cold, your teeth are a little bit sensitive for that second, that's okay. No tooth likes the cold. But did you know there are toothpaste out there designed for sensitive teeth? There are tons of them. I don't normally like to mention brand names, of course, and no, I'm not being sponsored, but I'm going to in this video. Sensodyne is the cheapest over-the-counter toothpaste you can buy to help with your sensitive teeth. I prefer Sensodyne Rapid Relief or Sensodyne Fresh Mint. The Sensodyne Fresh Mint is the original Sensodyne, and then the newest Sensodyne is Sensodyne Rapid Relief, depending on when you're watching this video. They have Sensodyne Plus Whitening, Sensodyne Plus Scope. Stay away from those ones, because anytime they add something to it, let's say Sensodyne Plus Whitening, they add baking soda. Yes, that baking soda is going to take away stains a little bit easier than the other Sensodyne, but it's going to do nothing for your cold sensitive teeth. There are other ways that you can whiten the teeth or even help to get rid of stains, but let's just focus on the cold sensitivity first. So stick with those Sensodynes, try that. But please keep in mind, once you try a new toothpaste, it's not going to work right away. So don't expect to not be cold sensitive a day later or right away. You need to use it consistently for a couple weeks for it to work, but then it does allow that protective barrier to stay on there. And don't use any other toothpaste because let's say you're using Sensodyne in the morning and then a Colgate or some other brand at nighttime, the Colgate's actually taking away the protective properties of the Sensodyne. Sensodyne has potassium nitrate. That's the key ingredient you need for sensitive teeth. If you guys have any other questions, I do try to keep these quick dental did you knows very short. But if you have any other questions, feel free to comment below. I'm always happy to help and I hope this did help you. Click like if you like this video and stay tuned for more.